Hi, I'm Lori from Quilters Headquarters in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. I am a certified instructor for Deb Tucker Tools Studio 180 and I have a little tip for you using the wing clipper. Okay, so normally we would, um, we always put our, our two corner pieces corner to corner and we draw our lines, right? Just like so. What happens is we get this extra little piece in here. I don't know if you can see it or not, but hopefully you'll notice this. It's two more layers that we don't need in there that serve no purpose. So to combat that, what I have done is I take my quilter's magic wand and I go from corner to corner, just like so. And I draw my line right here. I pull that one off and I draw a line right here. Now I'm on the corners. I'm not on my middle piece. And then I'm going to trim. Ah, then I'm going to trim on those lines that I just drew, right? So I've trimmed it off right on that line that I drew. Now when I lay them on my my larger square, they meet just like this that will eliminate that extra piece in there that you will no longer have reducing all the bulk see no extra piece in there at all just the two that you need I hope that helps you when you go to trim it and when you go to press it and put it in your quilt it eliminates all of that bulk thanks